uh, Tom, ultimately a disappointing result there, but um, another thrilling European fixture here at the Rec. Yeah, uh, tough game for us. Uh, I thought we played really well in, in phases of that game and we can take a lot from it. There's a lot of boys that took their shot today, um, but ultimately we came unstuck and the small things cost us. Uh, Quinns are a good outfit and they they ultimately stuck in it for 80 minutes. Uh, fair play to them and we, we had a few shots to actually win the game at the end and we didn't take them. Um, so we've got to learn from those and we'll come back better. And it was three tries apiece um, for either side. Um, ultimately, a couple of Brett Heron uh, penalties in that second half sort of edged the result. Um, what's all went wrong in that, in those small aspects in the second half? Uh, I think second half our line-out didn't function as well as we, we would hope. Um, I think occasionally we, we probably went for the jugular when we should have probably just backed our face play and won the ball. Um, but we can learn from that. Uh, we had a lot of new combinations. Uh, and a lot, and as, as I say, a lot of new boys taking their shot in Europe. Uh, Tom de Glanville, Nahum, uh, Gabe Hamer-Webb again taking his opportunity. Uh, so there's a lot of positives to take. It's frustrating to lose at the wreck, don't get me wrong. Um, but we're, we'll learn from it. And how good was it to see the likes of uh, Jackson Willison returning and scoring in the corner? Yeah, great to see Jacko back. Uh, it's, been a lot, it's been a frustrating couple of months for him uh, and he's worked really hard. He's stuck at it, which is really tough when you don't have a game at the weekend. You can get lost in rehab, but he's done really well and it's great to have him back with us.